Hello, I am Rock, and I am one of the grandmasters for the Judge and Makali Hash here on Jeju Island. Hashing is a worldwide non-competitive running and drinking club where a pack of runners and walkers follow a trail set by a hare. We run every other Saturday at 2 p.m. at a different location on Jeju Island. This video was made so you can get a small glimpse of what you might expect at the hash. After everyone has paid their hash cash, we start off by doing chalk talk. During chalk talk, the hare explains the marks and any important information the pack should know about the trail. The virgins introduce themselves and the pack introduces themselves to the virgins. Last week's front running bastard is recognized and given the horn so that he can lead the pack. Finally, the hare lets us know which way to find the first couple marks and the pack takes off. The hare usually marks the trail using chalk and flour. However, sometimes they might use toilet paper, fruit loops, Kool-Aid, or anything that may be easy to see depending on what is available or the weather conditions. The hare can choose to lay a dead hare trail or a live hare trail. Today, Big Bad Wolf decided to pre-lay the trail, so it's called the dead hare. The most common mark you will see is a hash mark. Here at Jejumakli H3, we usually use an X to signify where the trail should go. We use dollops of flowers to mark when trail goes into shiggy or off-road conditions. Eventually, you will come up to a checkpoint, which is denoted by a circle. The circle lets the pack know that the trail can go anywhere in 360 degrees. The pack then spreads out in different directions to search for marks. Three consecutive marks means that trail is going the correct direction. Unless you run into a bad trail mark, which looks like an equal sign. The bad trail mark means that you went the wrong direction at the last checkpoint, and you must return to the checkpoint and find the correct trail. Sometimes, when you get to a checkpoint, you might see that it has already been solved or marked with a half arrow or a line. That means that the faster runners up ahead of you were nice enough to let you know which way to go. At the hash, we welcome both runners and walkers. Sometimes the hare will lay an eagle turkey split mark. The eagle split is for our runners or those people who want a longer and more challenging trail. The turkey split is for our walkers or those people who want a shorter trail and want to get back to the start point quicker. The turkey eagle splits are really important in keeping the pack together. On this trail, there were a couple of times where the walkers or the people who took the turkey trail ended up ahead of me because I had taken the eagle trail. True trail is an arrow with three parallel lines at the bottom of the arrow. This mark lets the pack know that they are on the correct trail and should keep going in the direction of the arrow.
the end of the trail we have some refreshments and some snacks. Refreshments consist of beer, makgeolli, soft drinks, water, and sometimes soju. About 10 to 15 minutes after the last person gets back, we do the traditional hash ceremony called the circle. During circle time, we call up the hare and thank him for laying the trail uh, by singing him a song and making him drink his beverage of choice. We also call out other members of the pack for doing stupid things on trail, and those are punished or celebrated with the same traditional down down. We hope to see you at our next trail. For more information, we are on Facebook, Instagram, Kakao, Open Chat, and Strava. On, on.